Hello everyone, this is your Curia Fantastic World, letting you know that visiting hours for Hush House are now open. Welcome to the Book of Hours within Lovecraft Country. Okay, so yeah, we're going to be continuing our mission to use this super ink that we found in order to unlock as many high caliber books as possible. And since we just got Deep Mendaric last episode... We finally have the ability to do this one. Each flame its fuel. But first, first of course, we do cycle one. In which, you'll notice we now have two health fragments. Since I got them at the end of last episode. So let's begin that process with a little bit of a twist. Alright. We're good. Thanks. Alright, so let's get this in. And grab metal. Just in case. It's like a 5% chance probably that we'd get anything for this. But let's make it a zero, shall we? Okay, and of course, we want our usual helping out the fishermen during helping them during the dawn, helping them load their boats for a little bit of cash. All right, so that's going on. We also have to determine what else we're going to be doing. You see, I just realized something. One of my... Oh, well, a couple things, but let's start with the first one. One of my skills... Where is it? has what's called chandelier, which is basically the ability to make candles. And no, candles require, of course, beeswax. So in order to get the beeswax, you have to e access the bee hive during spring or summer. Now, it's, spring's already gone, but we're going to be doing this now. It's probably a 50-50 or 75-25 chance of getting honey or wax. But you know what? Hang on one second. I'm just actually curious. Yeah, pretty much that's the only one we can use. Health. So we're just going to use that. The second one for that. And of course, we'll grab insects and nectars because it's funny to do it that way. Anyways. Um, so yeah, we're going to be doing that all summer. We'll choose other things later. But in the meantime, for our first major action, we're going to be regenerating. First of all, of course, the book. Damn it. Come on. Cycle two, not cycle three. You get it right. All right, so since I think this one, yeah, it does allow that, we are going to toss this in. We've got Deep Men Dark, but that does not give us any additional, um, where is it? Uh, sigh. It's a with M for some reason. No idea why. Do grab the Super Ink, of course, over here. There you go, Seven Sky right there. Now we'll grab. Oh, is this one? This one's got a good sky. Ah, this one, right? That brings us up to eleven, and of course we've got compounding parable, which brings us up to thirteen. Which means we only really need one. We can use the lesser foss for that, and boom, there you go. Let's get that started. All right, so that's cycle two. That one book out of the way. Now. We are short, by the way, next of our um, Tony Parable, which of course makes it a priority. So yeah, let's run over to Eva's desk, pop in herb. We've got just first right there. And that'll give us the pattern. Now the secret threshold one, Almanac of Entrance, we'll use Fet over for the map table, which is still piled with paper. No idea what to do with that yet. I'm sure we'll need it. We'll just, I mean, I'll think of all the stuff I've just, you know, added up. Now for the minor one, we've got clouds, which got a moth here. We've got sacralimine, which can be used to increase moth skills. So we're going to be using traveling at night in order to be able to. There you go. Read that one over here on that desk. Boom. Oh, and we've got this one here, so we'll just put that there. And finally, which means we can think we can feel safe opening another room in case we get more books. That's the three. Okay, so what else are we going to think about doing? Well, first of all, we've got Foss Plus up and running. We're using the ink, so yeah. Solar, solar Altar is going to be in use. Oops, wrong one. It's inks. Inks go here. Uh, let's see. Uh, Christopher's. Excuse me. Green's a little cluttered here. Excuse me. Green's a little cluttered here, so there you go. Then we grab this stuff. Result. Let's replace it. All right. And since we've got it, so let's grab Revel 
Let's grab this for a revelation. We'll use, let's see. Yes, we'll use the, we'll need the wist for that. We need shot for this. We could use the metal or we could use the tryst. Let's use tryst. Actually, we might not be able to let's see how many. Oh, wait, I think, can we use it up here? Yeah, we're running out of places to use this stuff. Uh, grail, not helpful. Hmm. <laughs> Ooh, forget it. I've got a couple places we could use the chore, but it's not my first choice. Mm, sky, do, do, do. winter, brush. Yes, we're gonna have to use chore, unfortunately. Oh well. Let's get that started as well. Okay, so the rest of it. The schwist we're gonna need, as well as the shop in a moment, so those this leaves the two here that we currently have over. Oh boy. Stuff to do as per usual. Uh, hmm. All that lovely stuff to do. Hmm. A beautiful summer day at Hush House, and we're just reading five books simultaneously over a week. You start with, mind you. Teresa's to must, of course, be a speed reader, because there's no other way she could get this much information in her head. After all, she was a demigoddess of information. Secrets, in fact. All right, got another recording. Recording from the Abyssinian Abyss. Recording from the subterranean space in the mountains near Baghdad of conversations between the entomologist Juliana Zakowinski and identified presence. I'm thinking that might be the place... Isn't that the place with the mountains where you fight the, um, the giant... the worm um, in Exile DLC? I think so. I think so. It was near Baghdad. Hmm. Apparently I had a conversation with somebody. How oh, nice. How terrifying. This must be, of course, before the Exile killed it. Can do in a number of the uh, timelines, but not always. All right, so metal. The way they wage and it can do so is that remember that the exile is a child of two primordial god from stone bloodlines. Yeah, we figured that out during our little run there. We never actually finished anything but the basic run on that one. We did get a lot of lore. At that point. Okay, so water in play as it were to get that generated and now comes the massive 60 second point gods so much uh, all of these are gonna blow hmm lots of meditation going on in a very short period of time well meditation is extremely powerful for focusing the will especially if you can harness it for metaphysical principles okay also we're gonna need coffee that's right coffee more coffee we're gonna start having to buy a I already have some coffee on uh we have some coffee on um order and from the last episode. But um I need more. Any more. Basically gonna be running on coffee, water, and books. Thank you. This is my life in reality. Although a lot of times those books are audio because I will listen to them when I work. Sometimes they're from YouTube, sometimes they're from actual books as well, but there aren't a shit ton of cult books that have been read out loud. Maybe. My guess is a little superstition about that. Yeah, you never, so if you've ever seen Evil Dead series, you never ever want to read the books out loud. If you've ever been in Lovecraft, you don't even look at the picture. The Lovecraft, some um, Call of Cthulhu style RPGs, you never even want to look at the pictures. Okay, shot. Of course, per liminal meter. That's yours. Hmm. Ah, there it is. Bit of curious hunch. Get that in play. What? Now, let's see. We've got clouds, revelation. Oh, and there it is. Impulse. What we want to do is we want to. I figured this one would be rights of roots. Grab clouds, because it's got a moth in it. This has got a moth in it, and right we should have said good thing we i didn't remember to just save it but it's a good thing that we accidentally did there you go all right and as for our twist let's get the alchemy in play right we're gonna have to actually wait to the um to get the coffee served first we should get that first but won't take long. 
There you go. Yeah, we're gonna be using a lot of coffee in the future because we can make the we can make the um lovely Venethuk essence by combining divine light and coffee. It just seems so fucking appropriate. Hit it. Probably use other stuff eventually. We'll figure it out. Right now, coffee is just the most convenient thing, which means that we are gonna definitely have to make some coffee. All right, so let's get everything else running again. Get the books back into storage. Do, 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 do. Do, do. There you go. All right, now we need to figure out. Okay, I think we've got dandelion coffee down here somewhere. It's evening aisles. Ah, there's the dandelion stuff. We're gonna have to. Uh, I guess we're gonna be using. All right. Honey. Mm, it's an extra one. But we'll use it. Okay, so we want to make coffee. Let's use this fireplace to do so. Brew some coffee to replace the stuff we use and get that extra. Oh boy. Excellent. Speaking of which, where are we on this? Omar describes his work in the construction of mirrors for the enclosure of a sacred flame, a slow realization of a flaw in the glass. Ah, oh, that's bad. It also seems like an possible introduction to the lighthouse and the evil flame. Just poorly, poorly contained within it. And oh god, is that a story? Um, lots of cocoa. Cocoa's not nearly as good as, unfortunately. Okay. Now let's see what else. I don't think we can generate anything else at the moment, but we will be able to shortly. I think we will regenerate a couple of things. If we want to get this done, we're going to need to get back, I think, probably the Bost. Because I'm thinking we'll do Annaberry and Lapidary next for our skills. We'll need, of course, two Sky. We can get, of course, one from the cat and another one from Egg. Not the usual combination, but it'll work. There you go. Up and running. Omar explains how his light smithing techniques can be used in the presence of sufficient lantern to enrich the Zuck essence into the great ink of the first year. We already done that. Pleads caution it's useless the chandelier be realized. Which means that yes, we definitely want to use it. Because we want the chandelier desperately to come. There you go, result. And okay, let's get that back into place. <laughs> and of course, our new book for the collection. Oh my god, we're gonna run out of space up here. Okay, so yeah, like goes from eight to sixteen. Are we serious? Eighteen. 18. Wow, I've been busy. <laughs> I've been extremely busy. We're gonna need more space. Or actually, what we need is to put these back here. Seriously? Six. Nope, we can actually do this if possible. Nope, we can't. But at least we can get one more book in there, I hope. Probably gonna need more eventually. Oh my god, the books are just creeping up on us. Um Hmm. Also we've got this one. Take our limit uh, but I know exactly where we're because we can use it for this. Discipline of Scar, metal. Revelation and Lessent. Oh. Also, I think this, this one's got does not have land because we can't use it for that. Too bad. Too bad. We'll figure something else out. Okay. Also, is that clear yet? That's clear. All right. So yeah, what should we do? Probably a Faust is our best bet. And there's an entire pitcher of water. Oh boy. Mm -hmm. Alright, so two more. We have more coffee. Come on. Just wanted some coffee and another health. And we definitely need to replace that water. Oh boy, do we need to replace that water. Like. I think like one health is going to be devoted to just doing water the whole time. Uh, just pumping it out. 
little mill. Oh, wait, wait, pause, because we can also, if we're willing to spend the cash, get another one. Which one? Maybe chore. Or do we want to try and increase these skills by raising another Faust? Probably use the chore, because then we can do some collecting, which we haven't done yet. There you go. Ugh. Soon to be thanatholic essence, but now known as coffee. Mm. Alright, so next. Mm -hmm. Ooh, that could be useful. We could odds oh, from this one's the scar is now up and running, but you know what else we can do? We can grab the cat. Oh, we can't actually run a free soul fragment. So at the moment we're big checkmated until something until one of them generates. I gotta admit, they are popping today. Oh, that's okay. I cannot say I am not being efficient. Okay, but let's see. Here it is basically waiting on the regenerators at this point. Bed and this. Okay. But I think we not count you right in the bed before we can do a combine here. I need that for this or this, but I think the bed plus glacery plus... Oh, which one am I going to add it? Just... Ah, the bells and braceries. Always use the uh, base bar if I'm currently without. Meanwhile, we should probably consider what we want to do. Oops. There you go. Think about languages while you're doing. Okay. okay, so next we're waiting on this. Do one more combine here and boom. That's a day, literally. Ow. Think of a day. Hmm. Do we want to regenerate something else? That's a good question. Get this knocked out first. Also, braceries. Uh -huh. Got it. Uh, Fost. And. Ooh, memory. Whoops. I don't. Oh, well, we know how to generate a uh, memory real quick, now don't we? Let's burn something. <laughs> Burning will be our fire is our salvation. But I have the rule too, so I know what I can get rid of. <laughs> Everything's just popping like crazy. Alright, so should we consider doing another Faust? I think so. We can probably Probably get it done. Nothing else we can we can um back out for cash. Grab the other Faust here. Events. And so some refreshments were safe enough by doing it that way, but you have to be careful not to activate the wrong one. Get the water back in place over in the what's become the beverage bar. So I uh, just get that started. worried about that. Okay, so that's not going to work. We can use it. Else. Okay, we need to that car. Boom. Get knocked out. Am I quick enough to do this? Wow. I'm really, really stretching things. Okay, so what do we want to do here? Mm, don't work. Just thinking out loud, basically. Hmm. This one will not need to work. 
I'm just actually trying to think. It's too long. Maybe I'm going to actually just calm it down there for a second. Maybe we don't need quite this crazy about things. Let the night pass. Or we could use this to use this to generate, read something and generate an entire new memory to hold over. Like confounding parable, which is useful three ways. All right, all right. Let's try that in theory. See if that would actually work. Our experimental timing, after all. It may not work. It may work. But we're going to lose a cup of tea. And again. We need to replace both of the water now. Oh, we need to put something else in there, too. And it's even. I really don't know how crazy this all is, but it's crazy. <laughs> Upgraded. Hmm. And yeah, we'll get a third glass of water going. Because we can. Hmm, just crazy, I know, but it works. Water goes there. And the frost is back up. Okay, so we need... I was actually, yeah, thinking maybe... Maybe, like I said, what we'll do is grab Moon Egg, We're experimenting. Well, let's read this here. And then see if we can have enough time to put it in bed to sleep with it. That sounded wrong. That did very wrong. Oh boy. And we have this too. That's the only thing to do tomorrow. I don't think we have time to do regen today. Ooh, we're actually just chasing the dawn on this. We might have gone too far. We'll see. <laughs> yes, I want to get more soul fragments. Because, you see, the thing is, I've been holding up in the soul fragments. I didn't want to rely on them. Oh, God. I'm going to try that again. Wait, 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 wait. Uh, Tree of should work. We have a level one with... I don't think so, unfortunately. I think we could move that possibility. We would need to put in both a cult scrap. Or... I don't think I've got one that would work. Hmm. I didn't think that went through. I didn't really forgot we had this one actually running. Um... Three seconds is about all we could afford, too, so we don't have to... Oh, at this side Hmm. No, we kind of hit our limit. Hmm. The only possible thing we can possibly do right now with it, in terms of potential risk, is catalog, because that takes 30 seconds. Yeah, we are definitely pushing it. But let's see if we succeed. Hmm. Deep breath. But it was a noble attempt. It really was. Oh yeah. Oof, that one's gone too. Want. Want. Get that into the bed so that we can save it over dawn. Wrong. That's not his fallen. Interesting. Oh. Great. There you go. Let me try to put the book in there. Alright, let's go. So that did work. Let's see if the other part works. And it worked. Wow. We managed to get a lot in one day. 
Zoom. And we'll pause. Wonderful shape. The blessings and invocations. The triple knot recorded at Sanctuary and Cypress Note for weavers, sculptors, and gardeners. Oh, yeah. Using it as a fertility. It is a Grail 10, so and it is not disease. So let's put it into our usual spot here. I don't know if we have a 10 that's available. Okay, so 10, 10 is not a 10. That is not a 10, but this could be a 10. Right there. Oh boy, hell of a day. And more clouds, which you can use for the Sacre Lemonade all over again. Okay, so we can already see some of what's going to happen shape-wise next time. And of course, I will take my break and make my decisions. Hang on. And we are... Okay, so today is going to be a little different, I'm thinking, because we don't need to use these super ink every goddamn day. So we also need to, of course, help Jeremy along with his penance, and we're about ready to start with that. That's going to be one of our major things we do, and I think what we're going to do is we're going to listen to that recording we just uncovered as well today, which is going to be relatively easier as we've got both Deep Mind Dark and only a four scale requirement we should be able to do with a single skill. So... First thing, of course, is an update of Cycle 1. Of course, as per usual, we will be cataloging this book using one of our metal. There you go. You get it done properly. Now, simultaneously, we're going to be using Chore this time for generating income through manual labor, primarily because I want Shore back quickly, and this is the quickest way to do so. Now we have two health. One of those is going to be doing the well, because, oh my god, the amount of liquid we're going through in a single day. I mean, we're staying hydrated like crazy. we got to keep the water coming. And the other one is going to go take a walk. So yeah, we're going to be highly active this week, I'm thinking. There you go. And we'll send out... Um, now, let's see. <laughs> One probably not going to use Sky Stories. There you go. We'll go look at the clouds. Now, of course, we've got the Orflames testfully trying to sell us the same book again. But of course, we can't afford it. Probably won't be able to get deep into books until I have all the um, uh, language skills. Thank you very much. But, um, yeah, we've still got... We still, of course, have one gathering thing over here. And I can toss in a Triss to do it, because that allows me to do Moon. There you go, because it's connected to the water. And let's, um, let's toss in Drums and Dances. There you go. Yep, that's right. We're hitting all the gatherer, water, wood, and um, beach. At the same time, we're doing work and cataloging a uh, book, because we are just becoming an engine of freaking efficiency. But we're going to need... Take a look at this. Now, it's unfamiliar language. We need the deep and dark all the way, which is under M. And not other things. Let's check something here. Hang on a second. I apologize. Sorry about that. Your life intrudes, unfortunately. But anyways, yes, as I was saying, deep and dark. There is... Now, unfortunately, it doesn't produce any useful combination, but we definitely have more than what we need. Let's see. It's kind of funny, but can't actually use it. Can't use two languages at once, so horns and ivory, I believe, will give us four. And then we just need any, and I mean any, just about, that would be compatible here, because it's got stone. So unearthed, but also want to note something, by the way. This is a new skill entirely stone story so we have not discovered all the skills yet wow we've already like two-thirds i don't know how many books we got left but we always seem to be having surprises anyways of the earth it's forms of the dwellers living and dead okay so let's get listening to that shall we okay so with all that first major thing we have to do is of course summon jeremy but the thing is Light has become a super precious uh, commodity at the moment. We can, however, use Shapt, as he is a knock-orientated companion as well. Banyan, whoops. I should always get the other star before I start dealing with him, because we still need these two books. This one will be used with Timothy, and that one's going to be used for our miner, with the clouds to upgrade with Sacra Lemony's Lessent. So that, of course, leaves one other major thing to do, and... 
We'll find... Oh, what was I planning on doing? Oh, right. We're going to be probably producing some more of the coffee, super coffee. So, right. I should have the revelation book, too. Hang on. I forgot about that. Because we're going to be using a lot of that stuff. <laughs> All right. So, yeah. First, of course, we're going to use this vet. There you go. Traveling at night. Get that started. And then we're going to pop over here to... Er to uh, Use herb on Eva's good old desk. Two for the journal of her brother. Or no, wait. Grandfather, I think, yeah. Let's see what else we got. No one left now is metal, but we can use this in our favorite desk at the moment. Oh, we're going to need metal for the good... Hmm. I guess we're going to have to actually risk having to recharge one of these if necessary. But there you go. I'm kind of nuts on the gathering today, but I want to see how far I could push it. Plus, we're going to have to regenerate one of the, um, one of the, uh, Trist anyways. So, yeah, we got that going. Anyways, so, yeah. Let's, um... Oh, and we're going to have this as well, too, when we have a regen mode. It's all going to be a little crazy. I mean, more than a little crazy. But the first thing's first. Timothy, let's begin your penance today, shall we? First things first. Let's let's talk to you about what you'll be doing today. We need to get him up to 12 metal, which is not going to be an issue. All right, confounding parallel. Forgot all about that one. So yeah, hmm. We'll find use for it, or we'll just sleep on it again. Uh, okay. So and Forge will be back in just a moment. First 30 seconds, and yeah, there you go. Another recording. The admonitory, admo no, it's a film. Out of my project, footage of experimental devices and development in the Kubrick under Governor Colin is super, oh, we're gonna find like Nazi research here. Nazi style research here, really? Okay. Uh, Forge, um, yeah, that's gonna be a priority, I think. We need to check that baby out. Does not seem to be polluted either. Okay, so yeah, that's good, that's, or a certain, you know, definition of good. I think we need, um, okay, which one do we need back better, shaft or metal? Um, hmm. This one really, forge, I mean, they both have forge, forge edge. Don't actually, we know that's forge. I don't know, but let's well, just do our usual. I don't think we can determine from the information we have now how much we do but yeah three glasses of water we may go through all of these i don't know let's get that one knocked out and of course we need to go pour while we're waiting okay Timothy, let's um get you eating some magic pears, shall we? That'll give you another four points of forage. There you go. Enjoy. Uh... Not yet. <laughs> Ah, there we are. Now, which one do we want to generate? Probably these three. Hmm. Sure, probably. Boom. Pause. That's going to be Jeremy's discussion project. This is going to be the... Um, Xanthok Essence base, and this is going to be Memory Impulse. All right. First things first, we've got to pick which skill we want to upgrade. It's going to have to be Moth-related and for level two. Let's see. I guess it mm, said mm, running out of skills to upgrade. Interesting. Like, the only one we can really do, we could, this one's at level one, this one's at level two. So, the moment... Oops, we still need to regenerate something, though. 
Wait, what? Oh, wow. We can put a fast in here because it's got light related. Okay, cool. Go for it. Yeah, we're going to have to generate a lot to get stuff done here. Let's get the books in place, shall we? I know they desperately want me to have that book. We'll get to it eventually. I promise. Still, let's get these things done. And I believe with Foss we could do something kind of interesting. Hang on. First, you. Let's discuss. Our foresight brings us to eight. And the chemistry set. Well, you know exactly what we need for this. I think we need one of these. Second flush, as it were. Because what we can do has one lantern and it's a liquid, so it can actually combine, since we have the super fast here, with the glassware. Fast. Pointer, two pointer, and there you go, right from T. Because we've got the more powerful soul fragment. We only need one um, lantern in our liquid. Oh yeah, T can serve as coffee in a pinch. I know I'm probably offending any British, any traditional British the listeners I have, but I prefer coffee over tea, sorry. American. More horse. Cornish to plant as any, as any I, I guess. All right, cool. That's new. You see sand. That's going to be interesting. I think we can actually use that for Xanathok Essence as well. And... Uh, water. Which we will, of course, replace. We got a lot we could redo here, but yeah, the bed is still going, and I believe the inn is too, so no resets yet. Ramstead at level three. Okay, cool. That's done. How's this going? Hmm. I'll have to tackle it when it's done. Too many other things going on. You're at an eight. Actually, what we need at this point to give you a candle. Let's use that special ability, shall we? Have to figure out how to make more candles soon. That brings you to ten. Meanwhile, let's also get your tea ready. Do I need to... Proper tea for a proper British um, picker. Yeah, let's get that sand in place. <laughs> Rushes, I'll have to figure out where the heck we're putting them. Ugh, so much. Yeah, things are getting kind of... Alright, only Zawinskis' part in the conversations is comprehensible to the listener. The other side consists of grating, buzzing, and rumbling sounds. Perhaps only rock movements or artifacts. The recording process of Zawinski nevertheless unhesitantly translates. So she understands... Okay, Zawinski is the one who's speaking to Mendark, and she's translating for whatever the hell the uh, worm beneath the earth is telling her. Zawinski seems to believe the presence identify itself as a name or remnant of the lost hour called Seven Coils, which makes it a younger sister. It pleads for her to assist its rebirth. It begs her to find something for it in the city of Emza. Towards the end of the interview, Zawinski grows suspicious and repeatedly accuses the presence of not being the Seven Coils at all, only an inhabitant. The recording ends in mid-sentence. Well, we know she wasn't killed mid-sentence, because otherwise we wouldn't have the recording, but I guess she just leaves... Probably the smartest thing she had ever done in her entire life. Meanwhile, let's get a new skill. Chores up and going. This is metal, so we have to decide what we're resetting now. Okay, so we're going to... These two just don't go together at all, but um, we're going to need to... Uh, we have no skills to upgrade at the moment. Oh, wow. Um, Do we just... Grab another book. 
I mean, there's nothing stopping us from doing so. Uh, scene and edge eight is like the least we've got. We've only got one edge here. Don't think this has any edge attached to it, so we need to generate seven edge, and we've got only one here. So I don't think we can do that. What about that one? Moon. We should be able to do that one. The Malachite Supplications, pretty easy. We need... We've got five moons. Yep. Six, seven, and... Hmm. This is five moon. That would be seven. We need to have at least one of our Trist back up and running. Hmm. I think we should probably consider doing that one. And, you know, water. Now, we're going to be reading that, which is basically... Can we actually... Yeah, we can't fit the fear memory in there, unfortunately. Oh, well. We'll figure something out with it, or we won't. Um, speaking of which... It's a... To Earth. Hmm. Hmm. What should we regenerate? Do, 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 do. Grab the other tourist in case we have to use it to combine for skills. That'll do. Oh boy. Okay. Deep breath. Lots going on. do something else with chore, though. I should probably do it. We need water again. Oh, we need honey, though. That we can do. It actually requires... Ooh. A fragment. I should have brought that one up. Oh, well. These things happen. Let's double up on the water while we can. Saving the metal, I think, is going to be for the, um... There we go. Director's at 12. 10 now. Last but not least, a good cup of tea. Oh, a spot of tea there for you. Ah, oh, there you go. Let's get the uh, gorse. Which, I don't even know if I have gorse here. Good lord. Hold on. I haven't even gone to these vegetation in how long at this point. Should you start burning some of them so I have a little hope. Meanwhile, I think the solarium is our backup point. Which is full? Wow. I guess something's getting burned soon. Um. Hmm. Okay, so what we need? Shipwrecked. There you go. And let's get the, uh, let's get you catalog, shall we? Or bitch you about the grave. There you go. Need two books. Get you back to where you can be on the four level. Oh, well, that happened. I need that, obviously. All right, you, let's be in your penance and have you clear out Smoky Chamber. The room is almost still untouched, but little fires burn here and there still, like years later, li blithely ignoring the absence of fuel, filling the room with seven years of smoke. Have fun. I so need to... Oh, good lord. All right, so let's grab that book. That requires eight. Okay, so if that requires eight, one, three. Oh, we can do this without the ink too, can't we? Right? Oh, that's great, but um, 
And let's go get the globe. Moon globe. Okay, just a reminder, it's prayers addressed to the Malachi of the sister of the Triple Knot, which, again, to be a priority when we're doing books lately. I suppose I should put some vegetation around here, lighten up the place. Hmm. It's gonna keep growing, isn't it? Deep breath. Let's tell Tvera we're doing this. Close. We get a soul fragment back. We can decide what we're going to do. Hmm. Actually, what we can do... You know, technically we're... Spending more than we made today, but I don't think it's a major issue considering how we usually do this. We'll do something quick with it. We haven't actually experimenting much with the uh, earth-based uh, alchemy, have we? Uh, can we do this again? I think we can, actually. Um, this time, what do we want to do with it? Let's see. Could we do anything, really? I mean, next thing we should do is probably just look at something that we do at the end of the day. Oh, actually, what we should do is wait to see if we need to uh, investigate this object again. Sometimes we have luggage inside packages. As I was saying. Oh, yeah. More water. <laughs> so much water. So much water. So much water. And you can see why I went kind of crazy when I realized what beverages can do. Because I realized that I, how much I can play with them. Alright, so... Go for it. And now it looks like something's been earthed. Let me get the water in place and then we'll take care of it. Okay. Mm -hmm. Well, this looks bleak. Crucible Tower, Governor's Office. The Governor being Warden, essentially. The Governor's Office, quite quite luxurious, but at least by the standards, the cucurit collars was devoted to his little cause and his service. They did insist on little pleasures. Okay, so here's the thing about people like collars, by the way. When I was in the military, the absolute worst people were not the ones, you know, in the dungeons. They were not the ones, you know, posing with their victims on social media at... Uh, and Tomino, they were the ones the quiet, working quietly in little offices with no decoration and no, um, much, of, much more than a brass plaque on the door. The ones who carefully calculate the atrocities necessary to get the mission, get their mission statement done. In any case, we've got three books. Excellent. Catwink. Get rid of that. More paper. Good gods. A typewriter. Okay, that's funny. Um, a genealogical chart. And Sir David Green. Okay, we know what we're staring at today. Um, hmm. Meanwhile, of course, let's get this in place. I think we can get two of them here. And we'll definitely be getting this one unlocked. Put into place shortly after. But in the meantime, let's get the book. Where's that book? Okay. If we should flourish, not let our enemies flourish in that time when we are no more. That's suspiciously like Hitler's last words, by the way. We figured that Germany decided to get screwed over because it proved not to be the best strongest. So that's one of the reasons you really don't want the hardcore um, uh, social Darwinists running your running your world. All right, let's see what we can do with fear and health. Actually, hmm, this one got an earth. Is I'm just curious. Three and the new one. 
Stone stories, where is it? Got a skill called stone stories. Shoot, oh, there it is. Savage him. Raise the rhythms of the earth to remembered music. Eh, why not? It might be something we can actually carry in our bed. Also, it removes infestations, which is good to know. Okay. <laughs> I don't think we'll be processing anything else today. As it is, I don't even know if we're going to be able to uh, access those skills by the time we're done here. I'm going to get unlucky. Mm, no, I think we'll pull it off. I think we'll pull it off. All right. Meanwhile... Hmm. Hmm. Okay, so... Right. The cat wing could go, anyways. Nowhere to put the paper at the moment. I'm overloaded in storage. Our prayer describes how a strong degree of nectar aspect can be used with lethe and Tridesima Haria to bring forth the last nectar, the last honey, the living ink, the ink in secret. Nectar and lethe? Okay, nectar and lethe. Gonna take some thinking about. That's definitely not one I thought we'd be using. Mm, this one we can save, however. Let's see what else we got? Oh. Mm. Chaos. Hmm. Just impulse. What else? Hmm. Got a lot to think about. Hmm. Either one of these works with it, either. Hmm. Let's get this in place with proper place up here. Let's do some thinking about this. Hmm. Now, in the meantime. Get that out of our inventory. Um, hmm. Do something with chaos, but what? Happy, perhaps. Hmm. Chaos. Do we have any... Well... something we've done before, so it's not going to be new. I think it's at 3.3 point skill. Okay, so what else can we use this with? What else do we have? Chaos. Sorry, it got wandering off again, per usual. What's that? Oil? Or 
there something else? Hmm. Any chaos sign? Oops, up here? Sorry, wandering off mentally. Plotting, thinking. Ooh. Can make these. Handlebars are pretty easy, so. Why not? We might, have, we might not be able to get it in time, but it's an experiment. We might actually shoot past Dawn and keep it that way. Okay, a little crazy, but you know, this is me we're talking about. Ooh. So, yeah, crazy day. Um, yeah. I think this is pretty much the day, but it's pretty much the day, as it were. I'm just, you know, experimenting, seeing what we can do with things. Name Dero sounds interesting. Savage him also sounds interesting. And we can, in fact, carry it with us into bed, because it's got a... Carry that. Urge, urges valor and violence. Okay, so we'll find something to do with that later. That's just me carrying over a memory a more portable form. But yeah, we will lose um, the effectiveness of the... Uh, we will lose the Soul Fragment from regenerating, I believe, since we will have the name day rubble to play with tomorrow. Letters to my successor. Not infected. It's got eight for my turn. Pretty easy one to do. We'll see about tackling that later. Meantime, let's get it into this place here. Up here. Yeah, right in there. Interesting. Also, we need to find out where you came from, Mr. Green, because you're probably one of the librarians. You gotta get these empty spots in the staircase done. Yeah, I think we've done about as much as we can in one day. Gods. And there it is. The chin. Funny. And, of course, we're gonna have the Noonday Riddle soon. Whatever that is. Where do we put that, anyways? I think it's down here in the temple. Oh, gods. That'll be done in about, oops, 24 seconds. So yeah, so the next day is going to be interesting. We're going to have to start off with three memories, and then we can work towards whatever end we're doing. Probably could pretty easily do that book we just undid, letter to uh, my uh, successors. So anyways, this is Fantastic Worlds, and I am going to be checking out for this day, and I think we've got one more day to go. Stand by, please. And we are back. Okay, so I have a couple of additions to the first two cycles we'll be doing here. In fact, the second cycle from this point forward is probably going to require alteration. So, first of all, cycle one, which is, of course, going to be us unlocking yet another book. I like to think of it as unlocking, honestly. And boom, it's a nocturnal, which means it's probably going to be super powerful, but it might be varied, and that is actually kind of important. So, second of all, I mean, sorry, next part of the first cycle is, of course, helping out the fishermen with their morning launches. Using chore, because that's the one that's more useful, we'll get it back quicker. But I just realized something, we have yet to actually... We have yet to actually feed Terrence, and that just cannot go any further. So what we're going to do from this point forward is that if we don't have, um, if we have an animal that requires feeding, we need to feed the animal before we start gathering, unless it's a complete emergency. And the irony being here is that I can actually feed the chickens honey, which, okay, cool, we'll do that. Because remember, while we're in summer or spring, we should be trying to gather beeswax. I mean, if we accidentally grab... Um, we accidentally grab uh, any not too bad stores pretty easy over our extra. And last but not least, we can use one of our Trist to order to just walk along the beach. There you go. Probably won't be needing you today. All right, but now here is where the major part comes, okay? I realized when I was going over the lessons for the Ridsima Heria, um, 
that we had a problem is that I didn't have a lot of places to put it. Now the language was, helps a bit, like with Hikuros having one, but yeah, most of them are already level three, so I don't have a lot of um, places to put them. So I have to be more careful about which books I read, which skills they give me, because we do not want to waste lessons. Because we're most of all looking for ones that have absolutely new subjects, like this one, the Book of Dissolution. But can I, can I get up to a 12 today? Now, I can obviously read this for a two-point memory. I have two for metal over here. I have four for bell support, but I don't have a skill with four uh, with four forge in it, and I'm going to need Deep Mendark to be at level 3 to do it, and I'm going to need another one. I'm thinking Bells and Brageries, and why am I thinking Bells and Brageries? Because we've got a book here that we can read for two Bells and Bragery lessons. So I'll get up to level 4, and we can start working towards unlocking this new skill over here. So we got to get more targeted. So, first things first, let's get Herb here. No, oh, yeah, wrong one. What was that all about? I don't know. Let's get Herb and the journal. Essentially, I'm using, like I said, her desk to her, his, or her ancestor's uh, journal. So, it's kind of synchronicity here. Okay, so there's that. We're also going to get two moon, I think, to bring sharps up to four. Because that's, I think, will be the first skill we have four edge in, which is going to be necessary. Then we've got a bunch of edge stuff we can drop in here, here and there. So, yeah, we'll grab... Let's see, we're not going to be using FET today, so that's a kind of an automatic reading. So, boom. Mig, there you go. That'll give us one of those skills. And the Hill House Lectures. Okay, so let's grab this. And I think we're safe enough using FOSS for this. We've kind of caught up on our liquid, so we're moving in a different direction right now. Okay, so... In the meantime, we probably won't be using Wisps, so we can grab... There we go, come on. We'll grab this for this, because we're going to use Earth Sign today, once I get one of my health cards back. Alright, so... Excuse me. Get in there. Get in there. And boom. We'll get those skills up and running. Okay. So, we're going to have to wait on cycle two for this book as well, once we get the... So then we'll toss this metal in. We've got these two in reserve, and that FOSS is going to be used to join together a sky, because you notice that Bells and Brageries has a sky aspect. We'll need to regenerate a whole bunch of skills in the meantime, and we've obviously got both a... Um, we've got two sky-related uh, memories already to fix things with, like to add to our books. So, yeah, kind of just going with the flow on this one. And don't forget, we still have whatever the hell we've been creating um, in the background there, because it still has not There you go. All right, so name day riddle. Uh, it's not a persistent memory. Two, one, off to that. Okay, the way to the wood. Is this the way to the wood? But perhaps the wood is not a suitable place for librarian. We cannot access the mansus at this point. Now, should we bring up Trist. Absolutely. Why? Because we're going to be using that to combine the two skills that we're the two skills for the two lessons to increase our skill one level. So rather than the usual use of the forge aspect to regenerate the bed with the bed here, we're going to take a glass of water with the well, the element of water, as what Trist kind of represents. So I guess it's kind of appropriate. Anyways, let's get that knocked out. Obviously, we're going to have to regenerate at least one of our frag uh, heart fragments to get um, the water done. And there you go. Nair of the Tree, collected proverbs by Aunt Mopsy, who is a fairy. Once in the wood, we call a visit. Twice in the wood, we call a journey. Thrice, we call coming home. Because they are staying. Uh, Applebright Euphony is just another one we have maximum skill on. So yeah, we may not be able to read all of these books effectively. But in the meantime, we'll put you here. And collect you. All right. Get the other stuff knocked out at this point. Hmm. So we're gonna do with this. Hmm. Kind of reminds me of an Elden Ring thing right now going on. Yeah, I've been keeping up with the lore for that because I I find the sort of nihilistic gnosticism combined with cosmic horror like really up my alley. And anybody who has spent any time with this channel should figure out that why it's kind of my thing. The dark side of mysticism, as it were. Okay. 
And yeah, we got a lot going on in the first minute there. Terrence feels so much better. Uh, okay, one thing at a time. Sure. But what we're going to regenerate here is health, so we can get that to create the new ma magic pairs we used up. Uh, to replace them, of course. So yeah, there you go. We're going to have lunch. We have breakfast. Got that going. That going. That going. And, um... That going. Alright, one thing at a time. We want sharps uploaded so we can have a four edge skill... Um, four edge skill. Yeah, skill. So that we can... Let's see, where is it? So we can have that for reading purposes. So, yeah, the lesson. Boom, there you go. And, ah, oh, we don't have the effort up yet, though. Could use Forge, but I need that for something else. So we're going to be waiting a little bit on that one before we get our nap, morning nap done. Um, let's see. On the other hand, we can probably charge in and just start reading things. Let's get Forge for basis. So get metal. Let's get bells and braziers. Right there. Gets the correct one. Yep. Okay. Um, hmm. Grab the skill. Foresight. Brings us four. Now, what we need is a three pointer when it comes to forge. Because we have two and two and two. That actually works, which is remarkable. That because we need a three pointer because we need, we have a spanner for the remaining one. Boom. Anyways, the book, The Disgraceful Compendium of Rebal Poetry about the habits and corruptions of Henry VIII. And he had a lot of them. And was corrupt as hell. And if you remember up here at the tower description, he, King Henry, kind of screwed over the library by getting involved in the interdimensional war slash politics of uh, the War of the Roads. <clears throat> okay, so, yeah, where are we on this one? Okay, so, let's get these back in place. While we are waiting. Mm, it's big in the journal. Alright, there you go. Uh, sigh. Do, 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 do. Yeah, we're pretty much waiting on this one so we can get the next part done. Ah, there you go. Seashell. We'll be burning that later. And just honey. Oh, well. Help me for wax. There you go. Because I definitely need to get a candle done for the next episode. And that is because I'm going to try to make a flavored candle because that's how we can get Timothy into unlocking even more rooms in the in the jail. Gale, goal, whatever the hell. Pronounce that. Oh, for crying out loud. Get in there. Wrist up and running. Okay, so we now can we can get away with that. Sharps. Wrist. One lesson and skills. There you go. Should be getting our health back in order to do the uh, pairs short very shortly. Yeah, right there. Alright, so yeah. I can see we're getting short on the the lotion, the recursive bomb, as I like to call it. So we're going to need more of that. Let's see what else. We also need the wood. The wood will do. <laughs> trying too hard, guys. Really trying too hard. Hmm. Should have read it after I did this part. Oh well. <laughs> Silly me. Okay. Sometimes I get my timing properly done. Okay. But we still have these two. Let me get rid of the book. 
Henry's great misfortune, his crushing injury at the jousting bout, has left him unable to stand any straighter than a splintered withy. So it's a roast for the king, which really will get you killed in the time it was written. But yeah, oops, stop for one second. We are going to regenerate another health. All right. Oh, we got two pence there. There you go. Rest and refreshment. Safe to do it for that one. Oops, and we've got the bed open, which means we definitely need to regenerate one of our petals, because we're going to need that to do some combos when we get the uh, belt and braziers out. Although, because Foss will do the first one, the second level will require metal. Um, will require another one. So I'm going to be using metal and a glass of water. We might actually fall behind in our beverages. Aside. Always more to do. Waiting on the book, we're waiting on the skill increase, and then we're going to be pushing other directions. And oh, wait, excellent. I need to also order some more tea. I think Lapsang will do. Hmm. Plus arsenic. I keep forgetting to order arsenic. I need more arsenic. Don't don't judge me. It's not for killing people I dislike. I don't require arsenic for that. Um, I think because this is the one that does arsenic right there. All right. Then we'll get the lapsing tea. We're not going to combine them, don't worry. Excellent. We'll need to make coffee later. The most savage mockery reserved for Henry's great debasement, where the corruption of his softer metal is supposedly crept into the coin of the realm. Oh, God, he's saying he's limp, basically. The last and most serious lampoon makes serious reference to the Crucible Revolution, a.k.a. the War... the Leashed Flame, a.k.a. Ah, the War of the Roads. All right. First things first. Bells and Braceries. That. And... That. And that. Hit it. Get us to level two. We'll get to level three using Sun, Savage, Him, and the uh, Forge Fragment we're currently regenerating. Meanwhile... Oh, wait. Need to fill up this order form, too. Not actually for... Tea, but actually lapsing, yeah, lapsing tea will do there. There you go. <laughs> Be queuing up the post office today. Get to you in a moment. Because we need our water back. We've already got this going. And do we use the third coin that we got today in order to be able to regenerate again for another collection? Or I'm thinking what we should do is just... We need to read this again. I did it out of order. Mm -hmm. Let's, um... It'll get us back the skill, the persistent skill we need. I don't know what to do with this, really. Uh, let's get the lion into storage. Hold on. Everything's just kidding me all at once. There's our rule two. Uh, there we go. Okay, now let's go to the post office before it closes. see those in a few days. Arsenic and tea. Let's hope that nobody... Oi. There's up and running. 
Excellent. Let's see how close are we to getting the little fragment back? Nine seconds. Let's get that knocked out. Put this back into storage while we're waiting. Or Timothy's next penance. Very sweet pairs for his penance. We were being very kind. Okay, so grab Brills and Braziers, grab Sunny, grab Savage Him, grab Metal, grab Lesson. Hit it. No, I'm trying not to waste anything. But I do not think this will fit in here. Nope, we may lose the name Day Riddle, which means I gotta figure out something to do with it, which means I need another Soul Fragment. Gods. Might be able to pull it off for the bed if we were very fast. What we want to do with this? Um, let's make some lethe out of it, I guess. Hmm. Hmm. Well, we're going to be using the moth aspect anyways, so we might as well... All right, Trist. Yes, it'll be our third last day. Going to be a beverage deficit for the day. Bye. Hmm. But Bells and Braziers are going to allow me to read the larger Forge book. No, I can't. I need to get my, um... I need to get another Forge one done, because I need to get Deep Min Dark up to four Forge as well. So, that's going to be a priority book for next time. We'll figure out something. We've got plenty of Forge books I can play with. Like, for example, this one. Which is another Bells and Braziers. Oh, that's the one we just did. Silly me. Hold on. Level 10 here. I can probably get through that. Temptations of Architecture for Dorn Wall. Dorn Wall, Forge, and Knock. Do I have any Knock skills I can I can upgrade? Not really. I have freaking gone through those fast. So I'll have to pick another one. But yeah, I'll pick that between episodes. I don't want to bore you too much with my deliberations. So, put that in place. Grab that, level three, and another part of my not-so-evil plan is now in motion. Anyways, so, yeah. Get the rest of this knocked out. Yeah, there's another book there. We're gonna have to expand this a bit. <sighs> Get that back into storage in Eva's office. Yeah, we've got a lot of stuff for you. But, again, first world problem. I'm not gonna be too upset by having too many. I can't, you cannot possibly have too many occult novels. Occult books. Anyways. Uh, and finally, we're going to have to pour both those off at least. Wait. Mm -hmm. Get that going. <laughs> and last but not least. And at least we had it built up some reserve already. Yes, beverage management is a serious issue in this game. Alright, so. Let's wait till we get to the actual time DLC. We'll be able to do garden parties. No, I'm not kidding. Oh, gods. When the, we do this a second time around, I'm throwing in the House of Light DLC. It's going to be... Yeah, you're going to see just how... How crazily domestic I can get sometimes. Right, so, hit it. Hmm. No, I'm sure of Tangle Brag. I wonder if I can use that. do 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 <sighs> Deep breath. It was a it was a day. It was definitely a day. Alright, so what can we do with what? Not the best one to choose. Do 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 mm -hmm. 
It's not gonna work. This is new. Moth gold? Mix painted wistful golden hue. Inca revelations of precious gold creates moth gold. For scholar level, if I... Silvery moon ink. We already do that, but I honestly want to figure out what this is. I mean, it'll be something that lasts longer than the, uh... That's longer than this. The memory is going to fade. I might also use it for something tangible. Oh, yeah. Let's see what to figure out this is. Yeah, it. I did lose that, but I have no regrets because I managed to actually use it in for something. And we have another sunny day, so we'll be able to do something with that. Anyway, so like the usual, I'm probably going to send it here. We'll figure out what Moon Gold is tomorrow because it's next episode, actually. So, yeah, I think we've come to the end of this one. This one went by pretty quickly in comparison to the other day but it was pretty straightforward um yeah so yeah this is your curious saying that visiting hours for hush house and it's closed we're going to be accessing a new skill tomorrow which is going to be kind of interesting and um start things to that we have to be more careful more targeted about our readings so that's going to slow down a little and we'll probably move a little bit more into exploration and chem and recipes to see what we can create and before we go, there's something I've been considering. Now, somebody noted... Where is it? Somebody noted that there were potential ways to make offerings down in the temple below. And I noticed that there are sacraments. The Sisterhood of the Triple not use this in Rite to the Red Grail, right? Okay. We've got another sacrament. Chalice, oh, sacrament Malachite used this to Rite to the Ring you. And do we have a third one somewhere? Hmm. As I want to know, because we've got Calciate, we've got this one. Where is the knock one? Is what I want to know. Because there's three gods. Is that it? That's another Malachite, but there it is. Triple knot, right? So we've got three goddesses, three altars, and three liquids. Let's get this ham off of here. It's kind of that was kind of a joke. Can we actually use these for something? I mean, we've got a whole bunch of puzzles we haven't really tried to tackle in this game. Is this one of them? I've been thinking about it. No, unfortunate. I was hoping if you put them on here, it would unlock something, but it didn't. Oh well. It was a thought. You know, nothing ventured at the gate. Anyway, this is your curious saying farewell from Lovecraft Country. Hope you enjoyed this uh, your time within Hush House. And, of course, if you have something to check out, you can't because it's a closed stacks. Really, you can't. But anyways, I'll see you next time. Like, share, subscribe, as per usual. Bye. I'd like to thank my Acolyte level supporters whose contributions help this channel grow and hastens the inevitable digital apocalypse and rise of the Dark Lords of content and data.